Okay, konnichiwa, welcome. How are we all doing? All right, welcome back. Today, I've gone tremolo crazy. I've been looking at different kinds of tremolo and I'm gonna to talk to you about tremolo today. So, tremolo. If you don't know what tremolo is, it's kind of like a tiny little man and he's messing with your volume control on your guitar. So he's turning it up and down. Your volume's going up and down. That's tremolo. A lot of old amps used to have some tremolo built in, such as this chap here, which is from the 1960s, we think 1964 or something. It's got a built in tremolo and it sounds like this. Got it on the slowest frequency there, so that volume level is going to be going down real slow. And the other thing you can change on there is the depth, and I've got that on full so you can hear the full effect. Gonna turn the speed up a little bit. Or the frequency as they call it here. A little faster. faster this is the top speed now Going straight into this amp so there's no reverb, completely dry. Take the depth down a little bit, see what happens. It's just a bit more subtle. We like it less subtle than that. Let's go full. Maybe a touch less. There you go, there's a bit of amp tremolo on your Gibson Mercury. A lot of the times the old amps would have called it a vibrato, but they mean tremolo, because tremolo is the volume, vibrato is the pitch. Okay, so that's the amp. By the way, we're just using a PV something or other for the amps. Do you care? I don't, it works, so we'll stick with that. Maybe I should. Maybe you can tell me what's a better mic to use for uh, these videos. We'll pop that there. It's a Fender Blues Junior, which has been souped up a bit. So, there's your original amp sound. Next up, we'll look at the Boss TR2. I've been using this for years, sounds great. Let's have a little look. 
pop her on. So I've put it on at the slowest setting so you can really hear that tiny man turning your volume up and down example. Turn that off, do the same with your volume. You already knew that though. So that's the most extreme slowest form there. I'm going to set the rate and the depth to 12 o'clock. With this pedal you can change the waveform as well, so I'm going to set that to 12 o'clock for now. It's all pretty chilled out. So one of the cool things about the bus pedal is the waveform selector dial. So what you can do is really go for a very square wave and it's pretty extreme. So we'll go for that and put the depth on full so you can really hear that. Cool. And a bit of fuzz sounds really cool with this effect. I'm going to turn the speed up as well. bit of feedback okay and you can chill that out as well and it goes nicely with a bit of slap back but then I say that about everything reverb kind of thing. Yeah, the only small problem I have with the TR2 is the, the fact there's no volume boost on there. So if you're playing in a gig, kind of sounds a little quieter in the mix. The only way around that is to have another boost, which is another thing to stomp on. Or you can go for something that has the tremolo and a boost on it such as the Walrus Audio Monument, which is what I'm going to look at now. Mm -hmm. 
Got all the usual stuff on there. There's the depth and speed. Uh, you can tap to control how fast you want those waves. Another cool thing you can do if you hold down on the left switch it turns up the speed without you having to go down and twiddle it. Which could be useful. Um, yeah, obviously it's got the volume boost on it which is great, it can also be used as just a clean boost if you turn the depth down of the tremolo. And then one of the more interesting things on there as well, so you can switch between that kind of tremolo and a harmonic tremolo, which is different in that it splits the signal so the higher frequencies and the lower frequencies are going at a different rate. When the higher frequency is up, the volume's up the higher frequency, the volume of the lower frequency is down. So it gives it a different effect. Also gives it a bit of a phase effect, so let's have a look. Mm -hmm. 
bit of a phase sort of sound to it. There you go, that's some tremolo. Tremolo there, tremolo there, tremolo there, big tremolo day. Um, I think that's enough for now, so check out the website, check out the other videos, thanks for watching, see you later, bye, goodbye, bye.